Good. So you're doing good, but as she goes by that horse, I bet you'll, she'll try to slow down and get close to him. Good. Stretch up a little bit taller with your shoulders and your chest. Good. You're still doing good. The speed's pretty good. Go a little bit faster. Yep. Good. Keep going. Good. She's one I just, I wouldn't let um, stop to go to the bathroom because she'll end up being one of those fakers where they stop all the time, pretend they're going to go to the bathroom. But that's a good flat walk. And again, in time, this will get faster as you get better with her. But the, for now, that's a great flat walk in the arena. Just a little bit more leg. And I'll tell you when she gets there. A little bit faster. So right there is pretty good. Don't go any faster than that. Yep, and just push her out with your leg. And every time you're pushing her out, you might have to give a little half halt so she doesn't speed up. Good. Stay to the inside. Good. And then go a little bit faster again. So a little bit more leg. Keep the hands up. Right there is good. Beautiful. That's okay. So there, give a little half halt and bring her. So as she does the running walk, she's going to shake her head and your seat's going to go back and forth in the saddle. So go just a little bit faster. She's back at her flat walk. Good. So no faster. So now she's too fast. She's kind of up towards the saddle gate. That's it. So you want in between. So right here is actually a good running walk. Right there is perfect. Good. And just keep that outer leg on her so she stays straight. I know this is hard work. Good. Every time you pass that horse, keep your leg on her. So Just go a little bit faster. And then stretch up tall again. There you go. A little bit more. So it can be asked to you. A little more. There you go. That's good. Good job. Good. So when you get down by me, let's cut across the arena, change our direction, but we'll still stay at the running walk. You can just cut across the arena. Good. And then don't worry about your speed, but once you get back out there, see if you can speed her back up to the running walk. Do you need us to leave you? No, we're yeah, fine. I don't no, we're fine. You. Yeah, no, this <laughs> is fine. Let us know. Okay, so a little bit faster. Right there. Good. Yep. And either one, like if you want to stay on the rail now, that's perfectly fine because at least we had some practice off of it. A little bit faster. Keep the hands up. That's it. Shoulders back and chest up. Good. And then again, if she's not listening to your leg, your seat, or your cluck, drive a little bit with your seat. Just kind of push back and forth with her rhythm. Good. Keep going. <laughs> Go around one more time. I'll give you a break. It's too low and she's pulling on you. Just one little jab towards the ceiling. And then just release after it. Don't keep pulling. Good. Keep going forward. A little bit faster. One mile per hour faster. You're right. I want you to look at the animals, but don't stop yet. Don't take it yet. Just so you know where they are, okay? Good. So once you get down by me. Good. Stretch up a little bit taller. Good. And with your hands, just think of taking and giving. So if she gets too fast, use the half halt, but try not to pull on her the whole time. You want to give and take so she knows when she's doing the right thing. Go a little faster. She's kind of back in her running walk. Good. And you can push her back over to the rail. Yep. And then once we get to the rail, keep the rein short enough that you can half halt. And we're going to try to get her a little bit more out of that pace. So kind of take and let go. Good. Try it again. Good. A little half halt. Good. Keep going. Yep. Try to get her back up to that speed. Good. Push her back off that left leg to the rail. Good. Take and give with your hands. Don't just pull. Good. 